Previously on Code Lyoko, get ready to virtualize. I jumped right in the hole. Right in the hole. Right in the hole! I'm so done with everything in my life right now. Oh, <laughs> I'm going to have a big time. I'm getting dunked on. I'm getting dunked on. Play some creepers. And now, back to my childhood. Hey, this is Afa, back with a let's play of Code Lyoko Get Ready to Virtualize. I know that I'm scheduled to play Undertale for today, but... You hear that? Do you hear it? I fixed the audio! <laughs> it sounds like it's supposed to! Yes! So I was so excited about that. And the fact that the roofers are not making as much noise now, so I can easily edit out all the noise they're making. So I can record earlier in the day when I'm more energetic and less Hey, it's Alpha, back with a let's play of And more Hey, this is Alpha, back with a let's play of Code Lyoka, get ready to virtualize. When we last left off, we fought the Skiffazoa, we died a bunch of times, and the game spoiled itself. And I'm still kind of upset about that. Uh, one of you pointed out that actually it had spoiled itself even earlier when I was exploring the Hermitage as Jeremy. That it already spoiled itself. So, uh, so hopefully with the music like this, I think the graphics are faster too. So maybe those um, vehicle races won't be as painful? Um... And also, I can play other DS games without it being a pain in the patootie. <laughs> patootie? Who says patootie? Me, apparently. Okay. Oh, and also someone uh, said that it's not actually 20 chapters, which I'm confusing that with, I think, Pokemon Mystery Dungeons Explorers of Darkness Sky Time, which I might actually play for this channel. Let me know if you want to see that. Because I've, I've played it, but I will play that over and over again. And that had 20 chapters, so I might have been confusing this with that. This actually has 15 chapters, so we're more than 75% done with the game instead of 50% done with the game. Alright, let's go. Chapter 11. Which is based on... I, I actually looked up what all of these are based on. And I think this one is based on the episode Missing Link. And I don't remember what that's about. Alright, we were in the forest sector. Hopefully this will be a much more interesting video than some of my others. Just because I'm more awake. Okay. What do we got? What are odds combos again? I'll figure it out. What's what's the one that's Kamehameha? Uh, I don't remember. A A B A A B. Oh, that's something else entirely. Whoa, hey, look at that. That's cool. Alright, oh my god. Blocks. Blocks everywhere. Nice. Good job, Odd. And see, you listen to that in the background? That's what it's supposed to sound like. Yo. Way to go, I'm virtualizing Yumi now. She couldn't make it in time. Oh, now I remember what Missing Link is about. All right, okay. I remember what the episode is now. Uh-oh, Squidward's got Yumi. Oh, 
Okay. Oh, hey, I got a full full bill of health. Awesome. I guess I'll keep going as odd. Where was I before? Where is it? There it is. Uh-oh. Yeah, okay. I want Oryx for this, actually. <laughs> Oryx way better at transfers. Alright. Let's go. Ah, uh, don't, don't do that. See? can't get a... You can't get anything edgewise. Where am I going? Over here? I need that. Maps are backwards. Oh, I guess it's just a teleport thingy that I can't actually go to. I keep trying to press the enter key. For <laughs> keep forgetting it's not the same system. Do 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 do. I'm so happy about this music. Whoa! What are you doing, Odd? Oh, okay. Okay. My bad. Okay. That's not what we were supposed to be doing. So what are we supposed to be doing? here work wait I can download a, a Leoka power pack now uh, well no I'm gonna hold off on teaching you some combos Although I don't have very many chapters left to do it, because you need them probably for a boss battle. The final boss. The final boss. The amazing. Alright, let's see if I can do this better than I could the last time. Oops. Apparently not. <sighs> it's all good. It's all good. I'm in. I'm in a good mood. This music is not. This music's good, so it's not gonna. Not gonna tear me down. Oh, 
What it? I. Ulrich! I didn't walk the. I, I walked forward. It walked me to the side. Alright, do you keep the health? Yeah, you do. Okay. This is one way of doing it, isn't it? <laughs> Alright, don't fall off the sides. Ignore the tarantulas. And now go for them. Ta-da! Okay. I have Yumi back, I guess? Do I? Is Yumi back in the party? She sure is. Okay. But I don't want to be Yumi right now. I want to be Lorik still. Until we need Yumi. If we need Yumi. So Yumi was captured. Oh, it never said what the Skiffazoa was doing with Aelita, did it? It never explained. The Skiffizo is trying to steal Aelita's memory. Why? Well, that's a thing I'm not going to tell you, and hopefully the game doesn't tell you before it's supposed to tell you, like it said the other thing about Aelita. <sighs> I want to get that data wall. I thought it was right next to it. I hate platforming. I hate this platforming. Normal platforming is fine. I don't have a pro. <laughs> Usually platforming isn't a problem. I'm just sitting here, just like rubbing my temples, like, uh. <sighs> These platforms are so irritating. So very irritating. I cannot believe how insanely bon- because they are <clears throat> insanely bonkers. Why did I just spend it when I could have switched to someone else? Insanely bonkers. I swear to God. Okay. Now I can get the data well. There we go. And get to the tower. Platforming in this game is what to call it's ridiculous. So ridiculous. I hate it. Oh my god. Oh, this one moves rather fast. Okay, we need to get to this side. And hop off. There we go.
Almost to the tower. Save spot and fight right here. Fighting blocks. Let me get close to you. It's like freaking bumper car. Oh my god. They're. Do you see that? They're playing freaking pinball with Orc. What the heck? Okay, we're gonna. If, if I lose to you guys, I'm just gonna go get odd. Why are blocks? Oh, there's also a tarantula in there. Yeah, okay. I'm gonna get Yumi, actually. Get some of that XAB action. Remember that? Nice. Get going, Yumi. Alright. Now, Skipzoa captured Aelita to get her memories. Then why, you think, did he capture Yumi? Well, gee, I thought I don't know. Well, let's find out, shall we? Viewer who totally sounds like that. Another puzzle! Oh, it... Go, Aelita. Alright. One moment, please. Alright. Got it. Yeah. Power deactivated. Listen to that. Listen how good that sounds as compared to all the other times. This song would make my soul hurt. Now, now it's the speed it's supposed to be. Save and continue. Odd, Auric, and not Yumi. Yumi didn't get divertualized. Hey, where is Yumi? She hasn't materialized. We better talk to Jeremy. Okay. Oh, I'm Auric. Got my hands in my pockets. Don't want to talk about my feelings. Um, Auric. Talking back and forth. Hey, Auric, buddy, what are you doing? Uh, you know, just walking out my emo feelings. You know. <laughs> uh, he would be in the laboratory. Hey, Jeremy. You mean didn't come back from Lyoko? I know, she's still in there. I have to debug the devirtualization program. But Yumi is alone on Lyoko. 
That's not what's wrong, Jeremy. It's not... It doesn't have to do with the... <sighs> okay. It's okay. She's hiding in the tower. She should be safer. Her and Xana's monster's there. Yeah, monsters can't go in the tower. What about school? It's school picture day. She'll be suspended if she misses the school photo. School photo. You're gonna have to cover for her. What, are you saying I should put on a Yumi wig and dress up? Is that what you want me to do, Jeremy? I mean, if you feel like it, Rick, uh, I, I was just gonna say, have an excuse, but if you feel, maybe I don't, maybe, maybe I want to dress up in Yumi's clothing and, oh man, actually. No, no, Rick, no, no, don't dress in her clothes, don't do it. I'll find someone else. I mean, I was gonna say just find an excuse for her, but I mean, if you really want to. So how are we gonna hide the fact that Yumi's missing? Hey, I have an idea. You know what a good actor I am, right? With a wig, a dress, and a little makeup, I could take Yumi's place in the photo. And bam, signed, sealed, and delivered. More like signed, sealed, and suspended. <laughs> I called it. <laughs> uh, more like sign sealed and suspended. No way. Maybe we can persuade someone else to take Yumi's place. You don't mean. Yes. Sissy. Bum bum bum. Man, I'm a lot more hyper on this thing than usual. I'm just so excited about that it actually sounds the way it's supposed to probably sounds like a really stupid thing to be so excited about, but I've just been trying for a really long time to get it to sound right, and then I found a video that literally fixed it in two minutes. Let's go get Sissy. Woo! Listen to that. Instead of bump, ba bump, ba bump, ba bump, ba bump. It sounds like it's supposed to. Bump, bump. Ba-dum. 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 Bum. Bum. Going to get sissy to do a thing. Gonna stroke her ego major. Oh, hey, it's Million to Me's room. Look at that. Aw. Aw, look at all the stuffed animals. I bet this is Millie's side. Millie loves stuffed animals and stuff. In fact, there's an episode that it didn't show in the game. It's the first episode. It's called Teddy Godzilla, right? And Xana literally possesses a teddy bear that belongs to Millie, who's the little redhead, if you don't recall. Um, possesses a teddy bear and makes it grow huge. So it's like Godzilla. Teddy, Godzilla smushed together Teddy Godzilla and yeah she's a precious child who needs protecting they all are honestly you now other side can I go in here oh this is Aelita's bedroom I didn't know you could go in all these dorms just normally You'd think they'd be locked during the day. Yep. Pink room. Single somehow. Nice setup you got here. Got why do you have two desks? Why not just put your computer on the desk? Got some books up there. Don't know how you reach them, but they're there. I don't know what that is. It's pretty Bare room, not much on the walls. It's a nice bag, I like the bag. Uh, can I go through this door? This is just, yeah it is. Alright. No. Oh, there's no... 
Okay, and then here, is there another girl's room? No. Okay, it's just the three rooms. No NPCs live here. Can't go into an NPC's room. No, no. Hey, sissy, you're looking really... Uh, derpy right now. What's up? Hi, sissy. Can I talk to you for a second? Of course! Sorry, I kind of skipped over that. I have a really important favor to ask you. In exchange, I'm willing to do whatever you want. Anything? Uh, well, almost anything. I'm listening. We don't have class this morning, and, well, would you stand in the photo? Uh, would you stand in for Yumi in the grade 9 class photo? Pretend to be Yumi! I would do anything for you, Uric, but. Perhaps if I gave you something. Oh! <laughs> Clever! Clever, clever. We took Sissy's doll back in, like, the first or second chapter. And, uh, for the episode logbook. And now we're giving it back. Alright, here's your doll I stole from your room. Or Yumi stole from your room. My doll, you found it! Oh my god! You totally didn't steal it from me, right, Orc, darling? Um, no, of course not. I didn't steal anything from you, sissy. And why would I do anything to bad to you? You're... <laughs> Wonderful. <laughs> you just vomits on her face. <laughs> oh, sissy's not that bad. She helps them out. We just haven't seen that in the game, because there's no redemption for sissy in this game, I guess. There is in the show, but I guess not here. Yeah, she, she helps them out a couple times. Turns out to be pretty nice. And she just wants attention. She wants attention and she wants to be part of their group. Er, yes. I found it. Totally. I'll do it. But you have to take me to the Subsonics concert next week. I'm going to need some of Yumi's clothes. I don't usually dress for funerals like she does. <laughs> the one dress she tries to do before they uh, have to... She, she dresses in this like powder blue uh, dress that's like sleeveless or... Uh, no, no. It's like... I forget what it looks like. I think it doesn't have a back. And, and he's like, um, no. <laughs> That's not what Yumi looks like. Okay, I'll need to go to Yumi's house. Teleport me to Yumi's house. Thanks. I need to be careful getting those clothes. I can't let Miss, Mrs. Zishiyama see me. Alright. Oh. Alright, is there a around back? Can I go around back? No. I'm in so Shouldn't- Thank you. Are you telling me I'm supposed to remember which one it is? It's this one, in it? It is. Hey look, it's all nice and laid out for me. Huh, <laughs> it's Totoro. I think. No, I don't think that's what it's based on. It's, this is based off of something. I picked up the toy. What do I need the toy for? Okay. I guess I'm just stealing people's dolls now. That's Yumi's dress. Look at it. It's, uh, it's interesting. Very interesting. It looks really nice on her. You found the dress. Hopefully it'll fit this. It'll fit Sissy. They're similar builds. I should do it. 
Can I go out the window? Come on, the ish this is their mom's gonna be right there. Come on. She's not. What the hell? She's seriously not there? Okay, I wanna go this way. Okay, I can go this way. Hello? Okay, it's telling me don't go that way. <laughs> Okay, it's telling me not to go that way. Because that way's the factory. I wish it let you go wherever you want. All the time. Hello. Hello, madam. You're uh, looking nice today. Uh, I'm just gonna leave. Oh, what a lovely stroll through Bodong Bilanco. A suburb of Paris and it's like industry place bum, 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 bum. hey look it's Jeremy's successful older brother again oh it wants me to go here oh there we go gates of Caddick sounds so much better so much more cheerful and schooly yep 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 I feel like you're a theater kid this kid right here I feel like he's a theater kid they're a theater Hey okay, guys, Sissy. What if I try giving you the doll? Oh, does nothing. Well, it's not exactly glamorous, but it'll do. You can count on me. Thanks, Sissy. I owe you one. What's with this music in the background? They're like, oh, hey, it's Sissy. Shut up! I debugged the program, but it seems Yumi has a virus. No, that's not what happened. Okay, so the game slightly deviates from the show, but like... In... Not in plot ways, just in little details. <laughs> so stupid. Uh, she had like her DNA sequence code stolen from her by the Skiffazoa, and so like she just couldn't materialize. And then, uh, let me see if the thing happens. Is it the flu? I think it's been going around the academy. No, dude. Computer thing. Not. He's probably being sarcastic. No, it's much worse than that. It's a Xanavirus. Just like Aelita has. Aelita has already gone to meet her in the forest sector. You'll need to take Yumi to Sector 5 so Aelita can destroy the virus. Okay, genius, we're on our way. On to the rescue. Yeah. Chance scanner, scanner, virtualization. And okay, I don't think we've seen Aelita's sequence yet, so there it is. Wow. Continue again. Um, it's an odd kind of day.
Wait, where am I trying to get to? No monster there? Surely you just... Wasn't I just here? I just did this level. Oh, are we just going back to the same place? To get to Yumi? Because Yumi's in there? That's it. Why didn't you just take us directly there, Einstein? Come on. We gotta go through the whole- Well, I guess there aren't any monsters this time, but platforming's still freaking a pain in the neck. Oh, these are the shadow canker, dark cankerlets, right? They're cankerlets, but stronger. Oh, they're kicking my ass. Whoa. Hey, buddies. They're like cankerlets. It shouldn't be kicking my ass. Come on. Okay, um, what was his, like, Kamehameha thing? XXB. Okay. Like so. There we go. It's just got some blast back. Alright. Two at once. Nice. Nice. All right. There's another data well. Uh, is it worth it? It is. I'm gonna get it. And I fell. To my death. Don't care. Need combos for Oric and Yumi. And Aelita, I guess. Nice. Okay. Why can't I just use the overboard? Why can't I just use the overboard? Fly over this? Why can't I just fly over this with the overboard? That would make everything a lot easier. There's gonna be more fighting right there. 
I've made a mistake. And again. Go, shut, move! Whoa, there's this way. Is that where I came from? Hmm. No. I'm gonna go over there. Good job. We found a secret passageway. Fascinating. Was that there before? Watch Aelita have to fight. Quick switch to Auric. What's over here? Okay, first what's over this way? Oh, is this the way I'm supposed to go? Guess you can farm those little buddies. I don't have to go back, do I? I do not. There was one way that had super sprint. Eh, you know what? Nope. I'm not even going to do that. There's nothing exciting. When, oh, another one of you fellas. Alright. Call us a taxi, Jeremy. No, oh, wait, no, the taxi was vehicles. This is a big white limousine. Carthage, my favorite place. Except it doesn't have the music.
You know what? I want you guys to hear the Carthage music, all right? To, just, if you don't know the show, to understand how much better that music is than this, okay? So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to play it right now while I'm walking around. Maybe speed up my action a little bit so I don't have to think of commentary while I'm doing all of these uh, platforms. So... Here we go, the Carthage song. god finally that took like a thousand freaking attempts not that many but a lot of freaking attempts so that's enough of the uh Carthage music for now I think it comes across it's pretty awesome I don't know how many times I've played it well oh it's freaking Manta Where is it? There you are. Come on, Mantas. The other one is over there. Mantas, come here in the hitbox range. Nice. Alright. Those little buddies were called mantas. Because they look like flying manta rays. Great, you've done it. The virus inside Yumi is destroyed. I can bring you all back to Earth now. Okay, it didn't show it. So in the show, like I said, Yumi gets her DNA thingy uh, taken and Aelita tries to give Yumi hers. Because that would work somehow, and like, it would make sure that Yumi could go to Earth, but then Aelita would be stuck there, but it would also expose her memory, which could then be stolen by the Skiffozoa. And it was like, Aelita's learning to be, you know, earthy and human-y, but she's doing it too much. And, yeah. Okay. Ugh, another puzzle. So many puzzles. Okay, that was a lot easier than I thought it would be, just because I guessed right the first time. Here we go. Yay! And we're 
we're done with the chapter and this video. Well, where are we next? Is it another race? It's loading really long time. It's another race. Yeah, okay, uh, just crash, crash your little vehicle. Yeah. So, I, I guess I'll do my outro as Odd just keeps continuously crashing into this rock. <laughs> like a little doodle. Well. Crash. <laughs> it's so funny. Alright. Well. Leave a like if you enjoyed, subscribe, and leave a comment, because your words mean so much to me. And as always, guys, have an awesome day. I just keep crashing over and over. Why are you putting me through this? Because I can. <laughs> Crash, little cat boy. Crash into the rock over and over again. Have an awesome day.